Hey guys, Miss Jagger here, and welcome back to the front. In the last episode, we did a bunch of things. First of all, we made a move on Sweden and knocked Sweden and Denmark out of the war. Yes, now there is but only two factions remaining, with two settlements remaining, in fact. The first settlement is Palma, which the Spanish are currently holding on to with all tense and speed. And uh, very frustratingly, um, despite having two armies really close to one another, like reinforcement range, they should come into it. But for some reason, being intercepted by these bastards means that we have to um, take on three Spanish armies with just one force. Yeah, that's... Yeah, it's retarded. It's very much retarded. But nothing we can do about that. So hopefully in this battle we can win and basically utilize what strengths we have to win the day. So Brent Spencer is to, is to have his hardest and most difficult challenge of all. I'm hoping we can survive this just because then Brent fucking Spencer will be elevated to a position even higher than um, Michael Stowell. Uh, sorry, Michael fucking Stowell and uh, Duke of fucking Wellington. Uh, for any of, you who's, any, any of you wondering why I say uh, Brent fucking Spencer and Michael fucking Stowell, is that's a rank. Because in the game, he's so good that I have to put a swear word to compensate for how awesome he is. You know, like, he's he has lasted. Like, this Brent, Brent fucking Spencer started out in this campaign as a replacement for a replacement due to the French constantly sending assassins. And because the French did not send assassins after him, he was able to start kicking ass, taking names, and uh, having that ever so fine bubblegum. Even though bubblegum wasn't there. So, anyway... What we're going to be doing with our dear friends in the right-hand side is I'm going to deploy my Jaeger infantry to basically position themselves accordingly. Uh, nothing to, s to set up, though, because primarily we're on the defensive, so I want to try and hold the line as much as humanly possible. Right, so if the enemy's there, I want to make I want to tr make them turn into a trickle. So where where's a good hill defense? I'm thinking here is probably the best location for my guns. It's got a uh, roughly decent spread. We got a, yeah, we got a roughly decent spread. So one, two, three, four, five, six. You guys will form up to the right and help defend this left flank. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You guys will form up defensively to watch the left flank. I might send my first light foot actually also to move up alongside these guys to try and keep. Actually, no. I'll, what I'll do is I'll post you guys to the far left because you can take care of any cavalry that are there. Uh. Speaking on cavalry, we could post you guys to the far left and have you on harassment duties, because you've only got British Lutch light, light, yeah, they're only British light Dutch brig brigades, so they're not going to be as effective. Right, you guys, form up aggressively here to try and counteract, you want defensive fire only. You guys, same deal, defensive d tactics. You guys, I want you forming up marching up into this line actually before you do forming up here would probably be a good idea sort of start running quickly set up some stakes um, prefer, uh, to be honest with you I'm half tempted to put them in front of the cannon but you know sorry, we'll do that bit of a waste of time but it'll outset what's going to need to be done so yeah this is probably going to take up most of the video if not all of the video so Arguably, this is a good thing, but at the same time, not so good, because obviously, it means we're going to have to somehow... It means that this 71st episode is all going to be about dealing with the uh, enemy. Right, okay, let's go back to the start. Right, stakes up. And hopefully, due to the length of this position, we can actually begin staking up defences. There we go. Boom. Right, so we've got some level of cover for the cannon. Uh, it's not a large amount, mind you, but it's it's an appropriate amount considering. Right, now you, I'm going to try and move into the town. Because if we can, like, maybe occupy a couple of those buildings, maybe we can get some kind of uh, reaction. And the enemy is seemingly taking a long time. Why is that unit over there? The hell? Uh, what? Um, okay. 
Spain. Uh, what in God's name are you doing? Like, what? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> is this how they became veteran? Just because they made their guys hurl up with experience. <laughs> hey, I ain't complaining. You know, you gonna attack? Are you going to attack or are you just going to hide? Wow, okay. Yeah, sure. We'll just they're not they're not attacking, are they? What am I range on my cannon? Okay, so they're not quite in range yet. Really? Re really? My guys are right, okay. Let's see how much I can take the piss. This is either gonna result in them getting immediately killed or it's gonna be a nightmare. If I'm lucky, maybe one of those guys might be able to jump into the building and like hold them off for like however long I can. Kind of lucky that. How do you get? Yeah, they're not move. They're they're not moving at all. The hell. I don't understand. This is ris this is ridiculous. You know, if if I hadn't of um, if I'd have known they were gonna do it like this, then I would have put on the bloody timer for the battle things and just cheatily waited for them to to not attack. <laughs> Like, I would have just put the timer on and just be like, well, guys, after 20 minutes, you know, <laughs> they didn't attack and we won. Oh, that would have been lovely. Oh, that would have been beautiful. Hell, if this, if this PC crashes again, I might just do that. Okay, let's commit ourselves to the devil. Get my rifleman in position. Let's see if we can get some cheeky shots off. My guys are obviously going to be spotted any second. Like, they, they can see them. They, like, cavalry is probably going to assault them in a second. Seriously? Seriously, I'm offering you up fright rifleman on a plate and you're not attacking. Fine, I will happily take the piss. Get some cheap, sh cheap shots in there, guys. If you're in range. Why are you taking, are you taking friendly fire? G fucking G. Right. I think as soon as that unit starts routing... These guys get into the town. Yep, there they go. Right, go. Go, 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 go. You guys, in the town center. Go. Oh, crap. Shim can't get in the church. That would have been a perfect position to hold off. Right, you guys. Move, move, move. Into the church. Go. Um, trying to think where they can get take cover there's nothing there's nowhere else to take cover it's either that building or nothing right we'll try and get into the town at least and then that way you can try and take cover and decide to the, building, sir. the hell was that oh, okay Ooh. oh they're shooting through the windows okay cool go 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 get into the building Get into the town, come on. Oh god. No! God damn it. Right, get in the building. Come on, there you go, there you go, there you go. You are the skirmishers, you idiots. Right, okay. Now we're in the building. If we go into melee, though, we're screwed. They're wavering though, so who knows. What the hell are the Spanish doing? Oh fuck off, seriously. They're hidden. What? They're hidden and they're shooting. What in God's name? <laughs> <laughs> Seriously kidding me? They saw you get in. How the fuck do they hide? Oh, <laughs> this is seriously happening. My guys are just like, ah, badum, yeah, badum, and they're like, where the hell are we taking these shots from? Oh, please do. Oh, please do. Please. 
Okay, there's no way. They, there's no way they can't be spotted. They're like right fucking next to them. And you're shooting them. <coughs> yeah, there you go. See? No, you just... You, you st r r really? R really? You're hidden. You're hidden. Are you kidding me? What in God's name? Covered. Oh my god! I have never seen the curve by the Oh my god! Oh my god! I have never in my life had. S oh my god! That is the most retarded I have ever seen. These guys are legit not... I mean, they my guys aren't doing much damage to them, but I have never seen a more retarded system ever made. Oh, that's just magical. That That is magical. How bad that is. Oh, that's right. Keep heading towards my card artillery. Really? A day? A double day? And they're not even... What in God's name are they doing? Like, they're an elite army as well, and they're not doing anything to make this battle any easier on them. It's like, my guys were there, they were spotted, and yet they're not seeing that. Again, they're not really being shot at, like, they're, like maybe one or two guys are going d down, but they're not, like, dying in droves. Like, every shot they're firing is maybe, like, one, yeah, as I say, there's, like, maybe four or five guys who are shooting at them, but... Oh my god. Oh, look. Another unit of... Oh, please. Please. D please go into those spikes. Please go into those spikes. Kind of... What's going on with that cavalry? That's right. You run. Right, you guys pull back towards this line here. What are you doing in that game? Concentrate fire on them. They're gonna die yet. Yeah, like they, they legit will die in like five seconds. Oh dude, if that's the case, if if that's the case, I can send these guys out of this building now. It's probably gonna be suicide. But considering that if we lose, then they're dead already. Yeah, I can get my guys out and then we can do flanking fire. This is awesome. Right, go into square mode. Inspiration. Right, okay. That was that was stupidly amusing. Right, those cavalry forces are going to go down. To be honest with you, it's not the cavalry I'm worried about. Like the cavalry is 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 very small, thankfully. What I'm hoping to do is kill their morale, because these guys, admittedly, a lot of them are militia, but they're also some mixture of elite and infantry, like remnants of what they had before. Um, before I showed up on the scene, so. So yeah, I'm not looking forward. Well, good shooting, lads. Glorious victory, sir. It's soon to be yours. Right, so my guys can shoot. These guys will have first shots because they're light foot. Doesn't look like they will. They're coming into range of all of this, though, so I have no qualms. That I charge and death. Glorious death. And they're running into my spikes as well. Hilarity. They would have run into my spikes. I love that. Okay, so cavalry's dead. Ah, good, right. You guys. Okay, so the first of the enemy reinforcements are. Oh. I think they spotted my dude. Right, get back in the house. Back in the house. 
They've spotted my dudes. Get back in the house. Get back in the house that you can somehow hide in. Oh, hello. Ooh, a provincial min militia. Isn't that cute? I think they're moving to engage my cavalry as well. Right. Quickly relocate over to there. My guys are now in cover, I assume. Right, we've got a large attack coming in on this left-hand side. Relocate my lines a little bit to try and compensate. Ba boom. Right, I'm going to assume that cavalry regiment. You are going to completely ignore it? Okay, that's fine by me. By all means, enjoy death. Come on. Come on, don't let them get a free volley off. No. No free volley, no free volley, no free volley. Yes, there we go. Boom. Smack them into the side. There we go. They're going to get reinforcements, but if we can kill them fast enough, then we can jump onto the next one. Yep. Onto the next one, onto the next one. Go, 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 go. That's a general's unit, isn't it? Yeah, that's a general's unit. Right. Guns. Target them if you can. Now, these Dutch Light Dragoons aren't going to do a lot of damage, but at the same time, they are going to be able to do something. Right, if we can knock out that cavalry unit, then I can get these guys to get out of the castle. Right. You guys get back out of there and head right. Maybe you can, maybe you can ambush the general. Right, you guys reform over there. Cavalry, how are you doing? You're almost through those militia. Good. Right, concentrate fire on that regiment. Go into strap your shot and have fun. General and the staff, good. If we can kill that, if that regiment would break now, fantastic. Right, go for that general. Go for that general. General staff, for some reason, are really weak. Like, they're a strong unit. Semi-strong. But when it comes to infantry, sorry, when it comes to actual combat, yeah, they suck. Like, real bad. Boom, I'm liking what I see. Those spreads are beautiful. Well, we need to be targeting those in a sec anyway. But that said, the shrapnel shot we've got. That is perfect. Seriously. I love it. Right, who's in range? Um, yeah, that's good. Oh, very good. Very good shooting. Concentrate fire on them. Right, one of you. Concentrate on them. You. Concentrate on them. As in, could you get your fucking asses over to the designated point, please? Yes! Fantastic. First bit of the engagement. We killed their general. Beautiful. You guys can take care of their general then. That's a lot of dudes. I just went bye-bye. Oh, great spread of cannon. Beautiful fucking spread. I'm loving it. Right, you guys. I want you to form up as best as you can in as long a line as you can. That guy's still alive. We need to kill him. Right, you're on mop-up duty. You, get over there. Kill them as quickly as you can. Who are you targeting? Who are you targeting? Who are you targeting? Good shooting, lads. Keep it up. Right, boom. You, stop being in that now. You can form up and be more of an aggressive shooter. Oh, that's a beautiful spread. Well bloody done, guns. Well bloody done. Right. Keep shooting. Just keep shooting. Right. You're doing fine. You're taking shots from them, which is not good. Pull back. Pull back. Pull back. You're taking heavy fire from that fucking square battalion. Oh, don't tell me that this guy's going to die. No! He could get... Sir! Sir! Our general is under attack! Shit. Who are you? Oh. Hussars. Okay. Well. They're going to run. They're going to run. Yeah, we're doing a good job. Like, I don't aim to kill all of, you know, we don't need to kill all of them. The biggest, the most important objective of this battle is not to kill everyone. It's just to survive. Because then once that's done, I can then jump straight back into the action. You guys, reform and re-engage. You guys, engage them. You guys, fire on that line infantry. It's a shame that general's going to get away. Fuck! Fuck, 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 fuck. You, quick round, round. Go, 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 go. These guys are going to die. 
Like, we outnumber them, but... It's not going to take much to kill my guys, even if we're winning. No, what are you doing, you retards? Just shoot them! Quickly, round the corner, go! Stop running like mentally retarded sacks of... Wow, you just died before even getting... Ah, oh, fuck. Right, well, those guys are gone. Right, pull you guys back. Right, the Brunswick shooters are gone. Like, they're gone. We, unless they survive this, which I highly doubt. Yeah, they're gone. No way in hell they're going to survive another one. Standard shooting. You guys, round the back, round the back. My guys, pull back. Just come back and defend the base. Canister shot on those guys. Go. Right. Square up. You guys pull back. Good fucking shooting, lads. Good fucking shooting. Damn. That was really good maneuvering, by the way. Like, not gonna lie, that was pretty fucking good. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, what are you doing with a non-volley fire system? I... Ah, oh, useless. It's a miracle you guys are... Yeah, it's you're lucky that those guys routed the last moment. Right, go, 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 go. You guys will reform over here. Go. Bomb. Standard shot. I want you targeting... That general staff. If you can. No, he's out of range now. Okay, concentrate fire on that then. Yes, yes, please do. Please hit that. Come on, come on. Yes! <laughs> Red line of death just saved my ass. <laughs> Beautiful. And I love the volley firing. Much better. Very good job. Very, very good job. At this rate, though, we are going to run out of ammo soon. Let's just hope that the rest of the battle is um, them guys running away very quickly. Or them wanting to withdraw. Like, if they withdraw, I'm fine with that. It's the fact that my guys don't have much ammunition that worries me well it's not just the the month last not lack of ammunition but ah oh good those guys have finally showed up right you guys will just maintain the line i'd say we're done we'd have to well i'll probably send my infantry out to to attack the eager infantry but apart from that we're good artillery has infinite ammo so we're just going to keep shooting at whatever really shoot at the dragoons Save the ammo. Save the quick ammo. Right, so what are they bringing onto field? We haven't seen the last of the enemy. The good news is they're steady. We unfortunately have only killed one of the three generals so far, with the other one withdrawing. So if we can knock this guy out, good things will... good. A good day it will be. This is probably the most... Yeah, this is a full strength unit as well. The Cal Traver car guards. And they're heading straight for my dudes. The good thing... Is that when I load it like this? Also to mention, these are the Hell's, Ki Hell's Children Battalion. So they know how to fire a cannon and decimate with it. So. My guys can get a good salvo of that. This is going to be awesome. Hopefully this will kill them. And 
and they're gonna go straight into my yep Oh, glorious. They went from 100 and... Yep, they're gone. Completely shattered. Beautiful. That's a fully... That's a full stock infantry... Infantry? That's a full unit of cavalry just wasted. Who are you? Oh, the ceremonial lancers. Okay, so we've got... Oh, we've got another... Oh, the Granada Dragoons. Jeez. Like, the Spanish... We've... For a long... Okay, so to explain... For a long time after, like, after I defeated the Spanish, I didn't really defeat the Spanish to a degree. Nice. Um, <coughs> I instead basically put them on one island. And what was left of their forces was on this one island. And because they didn't really have a navy nor any kind of capacity to wage war on me, I kind of got distracted with France and everything. So I didn't really put any much, didn't really, I never really put any attention into um, sending anyone to defeat them until, well, now, basically. So from about episode 46 to about episode 70, uh, no, not even that. It was before that, that was way before that. I'm thinking we're talking like episode... I'm going to be polite and say we're in the 30s when it comes to it. Maybe the tw late 20s episodes and 30 episodes. So roughly... Yeah, roughly over 50 episodes of me not, not really having anything to do with Spain. Um, you know, I've, I've fought against them to a degree. Like, I think I've taken on their navy. Uh, actually, I don't know. I, th I think, don't think I have. I think I have just only engaged... Oh, well, do we think of the Spanish general? We need him as close to our lines as possible. That's a major cavalry attack, though. That is a major cavalry attack. Might need to get the bombardment on. If we can just kill that general, that would be fantastic. I mean, we're reducing the size, but we need to get a shot on the general. Come on, gunners, do me proud. Inspire the motherfuckers to do a good shot. Oh, that would have been beautiful had that worked. Right, here they come, boys. Oh, good shooting. I saw that. Fucking good shooting. Nice, not even the aim tended target, but I'm liking. Go crazy. Yes! Beautiful! Beauty fucking full! Oh, I love you! I love you, I love you, I love you, I love you! That's what I'm talking about! Yeah, no, you can go sod yourself. Right, canister shot. That target, go! Enjoy. Come on. Give me a reason. I mean, they, this is why that spike wall has done me a service. Look at that. That's going to hopefully route them in a good shot or two. Yep, there you go. No, not a chance. Not a chance. These guys might make contact. I hope not, but they might do. Yep, they're gone. Beautiful. Absolutely fantastic. Right, you guys. Now concentrate fire on that provincial militia. Now hopefully, because the two generals have gone down, these elite infantry, which I think is the third army are now going to be more likely to withdraw. I don't know how generals um, in Napoleon are, like, I know that they don't affect them t a lot. Like, they do affect them to a degree, but it's not like Attila, where as soon as the general goes, you've won the battle. Um, that is definitely something, yeah, there you can see, they've got, like, a full strength infantry of, like, taking a couple of hits is already feeling worried. So if we can perhaps... Uh, utilize that to our advantage. Maybe we can do a lot of damage. Also, if we can make them do the same shit again and again and again. Like, if they come in these very limited forms here, you might just do it. Right, let's speed things up a little. So, concentrate on that provincial militia. Go into standard shot. Uh, cut, sorry, clustered shot. Oh, lovely. That's beautiful. I love this. Now, if you're wondering how you can do this particular shot, which is out of range, despite it, uh, just just have the guns go from standard... Oh, okay. Just go from standard shot. Perfect. Ah, oh, beautiful. Kind of doing very well on ammo at the moment. 
basically you tell your cannon to aim at the target and then just swap. Like, as long as you don't tell them to shoot at the same target again, you won't have to worry. And the shell, which, to be honest with you, in Darth Mod, works very differently. Um, it has a much bigger range than it says in the game. Like, if you try and aim on something like that, obviously, when you have it in range, it's going to be far more accurate. Like, you're guaranteed some hits when it's in range. But when it's not in range, um, you can still do a fair amount of damage. As you can see there, some of the guys you can see are, you know, going back and out. Right. I will swear, I think, I swear to God, I think the biggest savior of my day so far has been in this battle is my artillery. It has done so much. Right, I might condense this line down a little to try and encompass this. So, on to the front, boys. Is my guys over here a chance to do some mopping up? Can it? Can it? No. Beautiful shooting. The downside is with this particular canister shot, the closer the enemies get, you'd think would get, you'd think would mean the better the um, the better the range. But actually, the can canister shot just goes up for some reason. Like, instead of aiming at, at the enemy, it just goes above the enemy. So, this area, this from there to about there-ish, is the best spot for our, for the canister shot. Any closer, and the shell just goes up, as you can see. It just goes above and beyond what it should actually be. Boom. Targets eliminated, gloriously. Aim on that guy. These guys are getting so many kills. I, you know what? I'm after this battle. I need to remind myself. Look at the results, because the amount of kills these guys are getting is ridiculous. Barrage on the target. Concentrate fire on the right. These guys are literally like, swing the cannon right. Fire, bluff. Load. You swing the cannon on the left. Fire. Oh, this is beautiful. They're raping them. It's glorious. Jesus Christ. If there was ever going to be a narration for this particular scene, I think we should just call this the cheese grinder. Oh, sorry, the meat grinder. It's literally, you've, we're turning, like, hundreds of people into pounds of flesh. Right, you guys are going to form up on the left hand, the right hand side of this, of that location. And you are going to provide overwatch fire from the right. We're going to, we're basically going to start wedging these guys in because... And these guys can actually move out and hopefully find that light dragoon, light unit. Guitar musketeers, line infantry, line infantry, line infantry, line infantry, line infantry, line infantry. Ah, there's the Cazadors. Fuck the Cazadors. By the way, Cazadors, Fallout 4. Uh, Fallout fans, fuck you. So glad they didn't put them in, in bloody, um... Are you guys marching or not? You guys are not marching, thank God. Okay, it looks like the enemy are reacting to that move. Go into stand. Go to that. Boom. Boom. These guys might take a bit of extra fire, but these shots are being landed beautifully, so... Right, there's the Cazadors. We need to kill them very quickly. I think we're aggroing the AI as well, which is a nice sign. Hopefully with these guys in position, um, these two will get shots in and they'll do a lot of damage. They will be doing a lot of damage. Pulverize those light foot. I do not want those guys surviving. I want that unit annihilated. There we go. There we go. Good spread of shot there. Perfect. Is that it? Don't tell me that's it. Can't be. 
there is a lot of retreating units. There probably is more reinforcements on the way, but at the same time, damn. Ridiculous. I really want to see how many my guns killed. Because I'm seeing a lot of death in the form of what my guns are doing. Right, concentrate fire over there. Cavalry, I want you to move up and tag those provincial militias. Rifleman, you know what? You stay there. You're fine. I think I might move my infantry up a little bit, though. My light foot's taking a little bit of damage, but so far not showing any signs of an immense desire to withdraw. I might just get my one of my dragoons to jump onto that, just in case. Because there is a lot of bad guys there. If we can kill them, that'll be pretty handy. Again, no pressure. I'm just going to rip the crap out of them. It's lovely. Concentrate fire on that unit. Right, let's speed things up a little. Oh, for God's sake. I hate the, log I hate the maneuvering characteristics in this game sometimes. Okay. Oh, beautiful shooting, guys. Well, you can't say I don't make it interesting. They're doing a good job over there. You guys are kicking ass, taking names over there. General staff over here. Rally! Ren motherfucking Spencer is now his rank. If this is seriously what's left of the Spanish forces, we've got this in the bag. Touch word, but we've got this in the bag. Like, we've killed so many of their troops. The only issue we've got now is that the left-hand side of my line is beginning to run a little low on ammunition. That is something that needs to be addressed. But at the same time, I'm fairly confident if we can just keep up this fire. I mean, I might replace the left-hand side with the right-hand side. But yeah, we got this. I mean, you know... As long as we can keep cheating with our slight advantage in range fire. I think the lowest ammo is currently my light foot. Right, yeah, there's that reinforcement. Right, you guys, pull back to assist in this group. Go, before they get free shots. Go, you mentally retarded sacks of shit. Okay, I'm not too fussed about, like, these guys. Again, there are groups of people we can take care of, and there are groups of people we can chill out about. Go standard. Yeah, so basically, so long as you target the said infantry unit with whatever. So, for example, as long as you target the enemy unit that you want to shoot at with your um, standard shot, but then you just swap to the different kind of ammunition, then then that'll be how it... And then basically you can shoot outside the range of your guns, which is lovely. Looks like they've caught somewhat... Like yes, good shot. Glorious victory, sir. Right, we're wiping the floor with what's left of that regiment. I'll probably pull my guys back because we've we've now got reinforcements coming in. Yeah, this is what's this might be the third army. Just got line infantry, line infantry, line infantry. Yeah, this definitely has to be the remnants of the Spanish army, and to a degree, Spain itself. So, yep, and my guys are becoming elite. And the men are fatigued, sir, and must rest a while. Yes, I'm aware of that. That's why I'm pulling them out. But there's no waste in having a bit of fun, eh? No problem in that, is there? You're getting some kills. You're getting some experience. It's all fun. I'm going to target you guys. Yeah, you're not going to get away with that, matey. 
Right, concentrate fire over there. You guys will be fine. Um, you guys are taking some level of fire, but again, the whole fucking regiment is getting free shots on this. I love it. Right, you go above the hill, crest it, because it, yeah, you're going to have to crest that hill. I might, to be honest with you, nah, this is a good defensive position. I'll pull you guys up, and then run range a little bit further, and I think we got you. Just go to the custard shot. Right, now you guys can withdraw a little bit. You guys are better on ammunition, so I will draw you out like so to cover the retreat. You will fall back like One so. Of our units has used all its ammunition, sir. Right, okay, you guys fall back. Unfortunately, you can't really do anything. Grab ammo. That's not really good. Well, the hope is you'll be the hope, hope is the rest of these guys will be running, which looks like they are as well, which is another benefit to my advantage. They'll be seeing their friends as well, which is uh, inspired by nearby unit. Yes, very inspiring. Okay, so is that it? Well, the left hand is not doing anything more when it comes to reinforcements, so maybe we might be okay. Then again, it might also be that their other units have yet to retreat. Right, you guys pull back. Kind of sure the line up a little bit here-ish. Yeah, about here should be good. Oh, and a canister shot. Concentrate fire on there. Yep, yeah, gone. So yeah, we've got another reinforcement wave inbound, I reckon. But not long, not long before we win this. Which will be nice. Oh, crap. Yeah, okay. Right, there you go. That's the best we got. Reform. Uh, now would be a very bad time to hit the accidentally hit the withdraw button. It's the hot key. I would say the placement of the cannon is pretty good. Right, go to standard shot. Begin having fun with those Geraz musketeers. Yeah, so the enemy reinforcements are still coming through. Once this, once this group of people have bulked out, we can then send a, we can then send some extra troops back in. Well, they'll probably be sending extra troops back in, so... The battle is yet to be won, but so far we're dominating in the engagement statistics. I think we're finally... Let's see, will they... If I pull back enough, will we see the last of the enemy reinforcements? Okay. Uh... Ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I think that's it. Yeah, that's it. That's the rest of the enemy reinforcements. This, this particular column of infantry is the last big wave, which is good does help me dictate this next strategy before I start mouthing off about how I've won. Yes, that's it. That's good. That's it. That's confirmed. We've. That's the last of the enemy reinforcements. This is good. Right. You guys will now begin to move up to, to we'll begin to move to engage. Let's see about this. Yeah, this particular plateau. Michael Brent motherfucking Spencer, ladies and gentlemen, has carried the day. Camping like a bitch in the background, but defending with a solid front, regardless. I see not any other way to describe this particular action except as a dra as the probably the best defense we have done in our campaign thus far. We were under assailment for 
three armies. Edward Augustus, due to bullshit reasons, was unable to assist us in this endeavor. But no. I say to you now, gentlemen, no. We shall have this day, regardless of the reinforcements. Oh, it's awesome. Right, anyway, so let's wrap things up by casually watching the last of the Spanish forces attempt to push our lines. I'd also like to take a picture, because this is something to document. Look at the bodies. My god. Like, seriously. Like, seriously. The amount of dead that are here. We probably killed somewhere in the region of 3,000. Easily. Maybe more. Maybe 4,000. I don't know. But regardless, we've wiped out definitely two lines, like two armies worth of soldiers. We've knocked out um, probably well over, like, yeah, like, yeah, I, I just, wow. Just wow. And my riflemen are going to rip the crap out of them as well. Canister shot. Right, pull back. Actually, no, no, pull back. Go, 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 go. This right-hand flank has got enough ammo to last. Committing too much to this engagement, are they? Like they're 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 moving, but they're not moving with enough purpose, which is kind of annoying. These bloody Brunswick's are doing their job, though. Jeez, are they doing a good job? Like. I mean, admittedly, these guys aren't in range yet, but still. Right, you guys. You've done your job. You've already taken sufficient levels of damage. You guys will form up and do a shit ton of damage day. Have fun. like General, General McCullen in the American Civil War versus Robert E. Lee. That's how badly we were outnumbered. It's ridiculous. Oh, and they're being petty now. Well, I shall be petty with them too. Boom. Brent motherfucking Spencer. He has done us out this day. Dang. 
Ooh, that was nasty, I saw. I just, well, the smoke uh, blocked my line of sight, but I'm fairly confident that all those tracers are going to be nasty. Right, let's cease fire with the cannon. I think you're finally done. Oh my god. One glor glorious charge to knock them out of the field of battle. Rout them from the field this day, gentlemen, and the battle against Spain shall finally be over. Boom. Oh, the Spanish um, cavalry that's been here for like God knows how long is still here. Impressed that they've lasted that long. And that's the last regiment inside the battlefield. Come on, route already, you son of a bitch. You're gonna get you're being chased down by a crap ton of infantry. Boom. The day is ours, gentlemen. Congratulations, Brent motherfucking Spencer. You've done it. It's taken us nearly an entire episode to do it, but you did it. You held the line. Three to one. Free Spain, mother... Free Spain v. Brent motherfucking Spencer. Right. So, let us now have a look at the results of that battle. Because I need to see how many kills my gun... Uh, how my gun... My artillery made. Holy shit, guys. Right. 756 died versus 6,823. The kills. Holy shit! <laughs> <coughs> oh my god. Wow. Oh my god. No, 1,117. And the other one was 1,900... Uh, sorry, 9... Oh yeah, one th that would have be been ridiculous. Wow. Like, the only person who didn't do the most kills... Yeah. They lost one, they didn't kill anyone. But I don't care. Oh, you know what? I'm taking a photo of that. Nine pounder foot artillery. Hell's children definitely earned that nickname. Boom. And not only that, the Spanish forces are now completely buggered. Yes. Right. Now you, Edward Augustus. Waiting for orders. Awaiting further orders. Right. You, you all, you all, you don't need to be in battle. You do. Now, because I'm a nice old guy, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna be one of those kind of players who really will have that as a cliffhanger, because, my god, that was incredible. So, in episode 72, we shall make a move towards victory against the Spanish. We're unfortunately having to wait a couple turns against Ivan, though, because it is getting a bit annoying that... Yeah, it's it's it, we're unfortunately in that stage now where we got to where unfortunately despite the lovely summer, uh, my guys are having to wait because bullshit mechanics in this game. But still, um Oh my god. Yeah, it's ridiculous. Right, anyway, um I'm going to end this episode a little earlier than usual uh because obviously. So anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching and I would also like everyone just to raise their glass or a uh, hand to Brent motherfucking Spencer for... I've got a glass here. I'm raising it up right now. Brent motherfucking Spencer for th taking on three highly skilled Spanish armies and royally raping them. Congratulations, Brent motherfucking Spencer. You are the top of the top. The creme de la fucking creme. I salute you, sir. Ah. I will see you next time. This is Miss Jager, signing out.